Welcome back to another product panel review here at MAC Fitness. Um, today on the agenda is another Maxis product. We have the IntraBoost. So this guy is a during your workout kind of product. Um, we've got it in three flavors and we've got two athletes here to test it out for you guys. So I'll introduce them in a little while. Give you a little bit of an overview on the product. Um, this is for maximizing your energy during your workout um, and between your working sets so that you're able to hit each set with a new boost of energy um, and reach that point of overload. Um, so this is helping to replenish your reserves quickly um, and make sure that you're you're ready to keep going um, and also that you can hit hard right till the end of the workout as well as boosting your recovery at the end of your workout. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Brooksy from Mac Fitness. Obviously one of the athletes here doing a product review on one of Max's new supplements, IntraBoost. So it's a intra-workout BCAA kind of uh, supplement, so yeah. Hey guys, I'm Sam. I'm also an athlete for Mac Fitness. And as Brooksy said, we are reviewing the BCAAs here. Um, I have tried a few BCAAs and intra-workouts before and I'm really keen to give these a taste. I like that. Yeah, that's not too bad. Actually, actually yeah. I thought that was gonna be super sweet. Yeah. But it's actually not that. All right, moving on to the cola. Yeah. I think it's not too bad. It's it, like a it's flat. Right. It tastes kind of like a flat. Yeah, like a. What was the lollies? There was a coke, coke, coke bottles. bottles. Yeah, that's what yep. it tastes like, I reckon. For me, though, I do think it gives a little bit of an aftertaste. It's not. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, moving right. on. I think that it's it's like okay, but I don't think it tastes it's like. In, it's definitely not as intense as a lot of the other grape flavored stuff. That's what yeah, you like like their grape pre workout. Yeah, it's not the same sort of flavor, but honestly, Maybe strawberry kiwi. Yeah, I was about to say the same um, thing. And then yeah, the cola was interesting actually. I didn't want it. Yeah, the cola was really all right for me. It's just it gave me a bit of a weird aftertaste yeah. afterwards, but it's still good. Pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. So as we were saying guys, the, this supplement you can take um, intra or during your workout um, and or post-workout depending. Um, so I actually don't take BCAA, so it's not a supplement that, I'll, um, that I have in my training regime, but... Yeah, so I do take them and it's just something I usually just sip on during the day. It's not something that I sip on during my workout, but... Um, these are really up there with other competitors. These are really, really good flavors. So for me, the clear winner, I think for both of us was definitely the strawberry kiwi. Yeah, definitely. Good. Yeah, that was really good. It was probably by far the best one out of all three all of them. Three, yeah. Yeah, and it wasn't like it wasn't. Uh, I thought it was going to be a whole lot sweeter than what it actually was. So it's yeah. nice not to be like, yeah, sickly sweet. So um, I rated cola um, a fair bit less. I gave it a seven just because, like, I think the initial taste is really, really good. But I think that just for me, the aftertaste is not that good. Yeah. 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 For me, I didn't mind the color at all. Um, I said it reminded me of the Coca-Cola bottle lollies. So that was quite interesting because that's I think that's the first cola flavored um, supplement that I've tried. So yeah. that's definitely interesting. Me too. And, and the grape. Yeah. Um, yeah. Look, it just wasn't. Yeah, I'm it wasn't so my used favorite. For grape yeah. To be just like that explosive, like yeah hit of flavor, but it um, just wasn't coming through. No, so. Yeah, I think grape was, for me, the letdown of the group. Yeah. But still, it's a good product, but just for me, it's not something I would get. So I hope you guys really appreciated that little flavor review. Um, obviously, Strawberry Kiwi was the dead set winner. As is always, I'll chuck a link down below so you guys can shop away if you're keen. Um, if there is anything we can do to help you, we will also have the Max's products going out at all of our sampling events soon. So you guys can attend one of those and have a try for yourself. Thanks for tuning in for another product panel and I'll see you guys next week.